season on 90 Day Fiancé, the other way. I haven't really checked in with my spirit guides, but they've been trying to tell me to calm down. I am clairvoyant, and I met my fiancé through a dream. Now, I am moving to India 10 days before my wedding. I want to watch you sleep. For the past two years, I spent every single second on video call with Mary. We eat, we sleep, we do phone sex, and I can't wait to finally be together with Mary. Meeting Kirsten just felt right, so I'm moving to the Netherlands to be with her. My makeup. <laughs> Mom, how many more? Even though I've only spent one week in person with Wayne, I'm giving up everything for him, but I know without a doubt he's the one. Hey, my baby. We can't keep pushing it back. It's time to make a decision. Having a child does put a lot of pressure on me. You're making this really hard. That's Take unfair for you to say. I need, I need a second. <laughs> <laughs> Tú eres una persona egoísta, tú solo piensas en ti. So go home! Get the out of my house. Get out of my house. In the last six months, I've been broken into three times. It's scary. I'm here by myself at night. When you were coming here, I told you how it was. I can't do this anymore. I don't want to do this anymore. She doesn't want you around another female that's your mother or your sister. It pisses me off. I'll be damned if I watch my son ruin his life over this girl he's never met. This isn't what I wanted. I'm just asking you to say you heard me, and you will not do it. Why won't you just say that you heard me? She's all about me, 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 me. How the f are you a clairvoyant? You are not respecting someone's soul and someone's emotion? <laughs>